Hey guys, welcome back. Jordan here, aka Brixie. So it's time to say goodbye to the Lego room. Today I'm wrapping up any loose ends. Of course, this is the old Lego room where we used to have Brickminton. There's the infamous pool table. Oh yes, that is going to be sold. And then we have our part bin here, the Ikea cabinet. This thing is a little bit too big and it won't fit up the stairs. So I'm going to have to take it apart to move it to the new house there. Also, we have one of our uh, tables here that used to host uh, Brickminton or the Lego City. And that's one of three of them. So I'm just in the middle of deconstructing that there. Now, we won't be reusing these tables. I'm actually going to be using the IKEA desks when we rebuild Brickminton in the new place. So we won't be seeing these tables again. But there they are. There's one last look at the old Lego City table. And then right here we have the cold room. This is actually one that was uh, hidden. So it was hidden by Billy Shelves. And the Billy Shelves used to just be all the way along here. And now when we move all those Billy Shelves, it exposes the cold room. Which just has like some shelving in it and stuff. It's a good place to store things and whatnot. Yeah, pretty simple. Now there is one uh, piece of Lego left here in the room. And those are the planes right up here. <laughs> I can't reach them! But they're from the air show set. Also, we've got boxes full of Lego right here. This is all the trains. And in here we have all the train track. Because I still plan on doing something with Lego in this house. We're going to be running the trains all throughout the uh, top floor. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and take apart this table. Weird. Look how big and open it looks in this place. So we've got everything out, except for the pool table, obviously. Pool table is going to be leaving uh, next weekend. Uh, lots of space. It's funny. You can see how many times I've moved shelving even after we painted the walls white in this place. You can see all the holes in them, in the walls there. <laughs> and then we uh, decided to uh, switch it from shelves and shelf brackets to Billy shelves. Yeah, pretty decent. And this is the uh, final goodbye to this room. You will no longer see it here on my YouTube channel. This is the last video, uh, which will show the old Lego room and I'm excited to transition into the new Lego room and the new place as we continue to construct it and rebuild a bigger, brighter future with Lego bricks. So all in all, it's uh, nice to have the old Lego room completely emptied now. Uh, we're slowly progressing with things over there and I'm slowly making the transition into the new home here. All the Lego is still behind me there. I still haven't even started doing the renovation in the basement yet for the new Lego room. Uh, where am I at with that? Uh, there's just a, been a few speed bumps here uh, just for the timing, trying to line up the trades and stuff like that. I'm going to say that it's going to be about a month before we can actually move into the new Lego room, maybe a month and a half even. There's just always things that take longer than normal. For example, I thought we were going to be able to uh, move, uh, get everything dealt with uh, at, the, at the old existing place uh, and, and be well on our way into transitioning here and making uh, things within a week or so. Uh, we're approaching that week mark here and I'm... I'm not ready over over at the at the other place yet. There's still a bunch of stuff that I have to do, and you can see uh, more details on that on Life of Foresight, uh, where we do lots of different vlogs and stuff like that. But in regards to the Lego room, it will be happening. Uh, we just got to give it time, guys, about a month and a half. I just wanted to show you guys the old Lego room, because doesn't it look weird empty? It just looks strange. Uh, <laughs> it looks very weird. So many holes in the wall and, and so many great memories in that room. Uh, remember to like, subscribe, stay tuned for some more great stuff, and we'll talk to you again soon. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. I wanted to give a special shout out to all the people who supported me using Super Chat and Super Stickers during my live streams. 
Thank you so much, it's highly appreciated, and make sure you stay tuned for more live streams as I'll be building all of my LEGO sets using the live stream function here on YouTube. Thanks a lot, stay tuned, and we'll see you again. Bye for now.